Hey everyone, uh, I'm sitting here surrounded by my tools which I use for the workshops and for the wrapping. And this is one of my favorite tools which I use every morning before the work, which is black coffee. When I travel, the only thing I take with me is this tool pocket. And I will show you a few things inside. First off, 30 degrees knife. Then stick from Yellow Tools, very useful tool for um, going under the rubbers and stuff like that. Then one of my favorite tools, uh, most of the time, blade breaker, very useful tool, so nothing falls on the floor. Um, of course, squeegees, I have two of them. So the green one, which is the soft one, which I use most of the times. And the orange one, which is very useful for the deep channels and the flat surfaces. Of course, mater. Blade, 30 degrees for my knife. Pen, which is very useful too. And that squeegee, very angled squeegee, triangle, which is also very useful for uh, going under the rubbers most of the time and for cleaning uh, in very uh, tight areas. Uh, what else? Well, glove, of course. This one is pretty used, but I really like it still. Still does the job for me. Um, and then for uh, paint protection films, I have three squeegees here. Uh, which is uh, the yellow one, which is the soft one for bulky elements. Uh, then the pink one for flat surfaces. This is the more stiffy one, but it slides very well also on every of the PPF uh, films I use and tested. And then for the very angled curves, uh, customized uh, squeegee made of, uh, I don't know, but very, very good tool, in my opinion. Very important are these magnets. Um, so uh, these tools are the tools I'm taking always with me um, for, the, for the training days uh, abroad. And I will show you right now some of the tools, I mean, all the tools I use here in my shop. Uh, this tool right here is the jet wash. Um, the main reason I bought exactly this one is that it has really, really strong pressure in the pump. Um, so I use this one for cleaning the cars, of course. Um, um, to complete this set, I bought also this washing glove from Workstuff. Really cool stuff. It creates very, very strong foam. And this brush to clean the wheels. So the other element of this set is this bucket, which has really cool element, which is the separator, which makes washing the car very secure because this one separates the, uh, all the dust and dirt from the clean water. And the last element of this whole set is this towel, this microfiber towel, which absorbs a lot, a lot of water. And with this towel, I think I can, uh, I can dry at least three cars in one go. This tool here is the uh, steamer I use for the paint protection films to make them softer, to conform better. The next tool I also use for the paint protection film is this sprayer, which I use for spraying the installation liquid. One of the most important tools in our industry, right after the knife and the squeegee, the heat gun. You can't work without one. You might ask why this particular one? Well, I think it's built like a tank. It can drop from the ladder six meters and it's still going to work. None other can do that. It's very easy in use. It's long lasting and it's super cheap. For cleaning, I use alcohol-based cleaner, but it also happens that I use 100% pure isopropyl alcohol and to give it extra more performance I use microfiber wipes. When I'm walking around the car with my heat gun that extension cable is a must but sometimes I'm using not only one heat gun but also the hair dryer or two heat guns and then I'm using that splitter. 
As some of you may know, I'm not the tallest guy. So, you know, I sometimes need an elevation. And here are the two items which helps a lot with this. First off, that little tool for not so demanding heights. And this whole box for the most demanding heights. Last but not least, this heater. I tend to get cold very, very easy. And it helps to prevent that. And as you may remember, coffee is one of my favorite tools. And this helps to keep it warm.